I am Rachel Saffer um, and I studied international management at the University of Manchester Business School. So as part of my degree, I went to Singapore Management University, um, obviously in Singapore, um, and it was quite possibly the best year of my life. Um, and that's where I specialised in advertising and marketing, which is what I now do. So um, personal and academic skills that I developed abroad um, really stemmed from um, the courses that I chose. Um, I wanted to go, by, by my third year I knew I wanted to go into advertising and marketing, so I chose very advertising and marketing related courses. Um, but also I realised that I needed to work on my presenting skills, my presentation skills, so I also did drama as a module whilst I was out there. Um, personally, it helped me be a better presenter. I learned a huge amount about advertising whilst I was out there um, because of those sort of uh, training skills. I ended up kind of being quite good in that remit and now I present to CMOs and CEOs all over the world um, on a kind of weekly basis. Um, so that's both, both a kind of personal and professional skills I developed. Um, personally, it made me a lot more open. Being in a country that you've never been to before, potentially with only two other people that you may not have really even spoken to on your degree. Um, you learn about yourself, how you deal with being in certain situations, you know, kind of not being in your comfort zone. And I think that is absolutely crucial for any person who's 21 um, to kind of go and, go and put themselves out there and, and break through that barrier. Absolutely. Um, not only do I travel a lot to Singapore now, um, I travel a lot to APAC in general, um, but I travel to, um, to America a lot, to Dubai, to South Africa, um, and to, to Europe, obviously, and actually learning how different people do business in different ways, how they present different ideas to you, how they hold meetings. And um, all of that sort of knowledge I gained from, work, from being in Singapore, from, from working with other people, um, working with different people from different backgrounds in Singapore, which meant that by the time I got to the workplace and I was doing a lot more international work, um, I was comfortable working in amongst different cultures, um, people from all different countries with language barriers, time differences as well. <laughs> um, and understanding how to do that I, I was all from my, from my year abroad. If I could put my year abroad into a few words, um, I would say best year of my life. Shadow of doubt, yeah. <laughs> Absolutely, really simple, do it. If you're going to do an, a, a management degree, um, the world is getting smaller by the day. Um, you need to be able to work internationally. You need to be comfortable working in different culture, with different cultures and the way that they do business, the way that they understand different paradigms and theories within the management world, whether you're in finance, whether you're in marketing, advertising, whether you do HR, you're gonna need those crucial skills and the best way to do that is to go abroad. If you're considering um, doing a year abroad, um, choose your country wisely, do something that's gonna really kind of break through your comfort barrier, but just do it. Thank mm -hmm. you.